Hey, it's your girl Key with Murder by Reason. I am so excited to do this video today because I will be doing a summary and a review on the book called The Third Victim. This is by Philip McGorlin. Um, it is set in Oregon um, about this victim. Her name is Meredith. She was found on the side of the road by a local uh, man named Caleb. He takes her to the hospital. Um, he calls his cousin, who is um, a local cop there in Hammond uh, County. His name is Harry. He goes in, you know, gets a statement. Um, and because they don't deal with this, these type of crimes when you live in a small county, they call in the big dog. So we have Carrie... Uh, Anderson and Roger Dillon coming from Portland to take a statement from Meredith. Uh, and because this is so crucial is because they found two um, dead women with the same injuries as Meredith. So we know that this is a serial killer who kidnapped two other women, um, abused them, and then murdered them. And Meredith got away. So that's all what's happening like in the first two to three chapters. Uh, about the time at the end of the fourth chapter, um, they basically ask Meredith if she's up to kind of like backtrack on uh, how she got away. If she could remember what the cabin looked like because she said she was taken into um, a cabin by the lake. She could hear the water. Uh, and there's a lot of cabins. Them are like summer homes for the rich people. Um, but she said it was a more modern cabin, cabin, not like your old wood. It was like more model, modern and metal type cabin. Um, so luckily they do a search party. She's able to remember, uh, what the, you know, once she sees the cabin, she recognized it. The door, back door is still open from how, when she escaped. Um, uh, and crazy thing is they already got a warrant. Come to find out, the house is uh, registered to a attorney in Portland named Alex Mason. So, of course, they go arrest Mr. Mason, um, and he says he need a lawyer. And the lawyer he asks for is Regina Bannister. And then that's when we get cut into who Regina is. Regina is a lawyer, a big top uh, criminal defense lawyer in Oregon. Uh, they call her the sorceress because she get most of her uh, clients wins. Like she been getting not guilty verdicts. So she's that good. So he asked for her. They know each other, of course, because he's also a big time uh, lawyer in Portland. Okay.